hello to you. It's that time, Phantasm 5, Ravager. Now, before we get into the reaction, I need to tell you guys that I looked up the Phantasm franchise and was led to believe for some reason that it was six, but it's not. It's only five. So this is the last one. From the little bit that I did read when I looked up this movie, Phantasm Ravager, which is the fifth and fifth one, uh, is supposed to kind of like wrap up things. Thought that suggests the possibility that one could be in two places at once. anticipating finding out and connecting the dots with phantasm hopefully because this has been one wild freaky ride but i've enjoyed myself so let's press play on phantasm ravager oh look at reggie oh reggie looked like the hell he been through my goodness because of him he's a shapeshifter Mm -hmm. With superhuman strength, mm -hmm. he enslaves the dead, uses them to create terror. He has the power to channel time, dimensions, mm -hmm. He was a scientist in a past life who crossed the threshold to a red world and came back changed. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Clocking so he's still... Trying to get Mike, Mike, or is he trying to save job. Mike? Because Mike My was dying at the last one. Brother Mike, who I swore to protect. They're gone. Okay, so we got a random just popping up out of nowhere. He actually got money on him? Did he stop at a 7 Eleven in one of the portals? for being a dummy gonna pick the man up in his own car well he needs them wheels thanks a lot asshole oh no he didn't you stole the man's car oh wait not the balls oh so now they come to kill out of nowhere they know how to come out of the mausoleum now? Oh, no. Why do they still got to do that? Oh. Oh. It's chasing you. It's chasing Reggie. Oh, and this is 2016, right? So this is CGI. Yes, Reggie. Yes. Yeah. Oh. They make noise? The balls make noise now. Wait, now how did we end up at Shady Acres? What is going on? Is this real present day? Reggie in the nursing home? 
And might come to visit him? Oh, man. I thought we was not going to confuse me. Where is this? They found you wandering in the desert. Like Moses. Right. Oh. Um. Looking for you for so long. And now you're here. Yes, you're right here. You have dementia. Oh. Dementia. Now, did he get that because he'd been traveling through time so much looking for Mike? That was just another one of his tricks. Yeah, I see it all now. But then again, since the very first movie, we have been looking at dreams. So, whether they've been real or not, they have been altered reality. So, I could see how now we're being exposed to what's really going on. I'm tracking you. Wow. It starts with me coming. Now, is he jumping through time now? Like he done went back to the 70s, to the cabin. Now he in the old time hospital with the time man as, well, this should be Jebediah as his roommate. Child, if Don ain't answering. Dawn and probably turned into one of them little zombies, honey. Or one of them little people in them brown robes gonna jump out. It's probably one of them little monsters. Damn, Don. The, the, oh, why they gotta give us a close up? The silver ball and took Don out. Oh, close the door. Run, run. Ooh. Run, Reggie. Oh, so there's multiple. Okay, so there's multiple portals. We know that. We saw that in four in oblivion but now we're seeing that everything is happening at the same time so there's like a whole multiple dimensions and they're all happening all these different timelines are happening at the same time so we have all these different versions of Reggie Mike probably even Jody here and there before he got killed because he turned evil okay different versions of the tall man Okay, okay. <laughs> Freaking little monsters. Oh, Reggie, you know you in the mausoleum. You gotta be on guard. Oh. Oh, Lord. Another demon zombie lady. Oh, that's the lady who stabbed you from the first one? Man, if you don't pop one in her dome. Reggie, you cannot be that hard up, bro. I understand you haven't had no female company, but shoot her. Shoot her. Shoot her! Reggie? Bro. Hello? See? Now do you... Why did she have to do that? Oh my God. Generosity is fleeting. How are you gonna be with his family again? This moment. Do you think I want your reanimated zombies? My friend, Mike, and
and his brother Jody. If you free them, I'll step out of your way. Jo Jody dead, honey. How are you gonna bring no now Mike yeah. You can never understand. It's called loyalty. Oh, I'll run. And I've enjoyed your despair. But my use for you is at an end. Oh You're not even real. So are their dreams connected? So the time man can patch into Is he? Child, he been time jumping. He saw you in another world, you was gone and you got messed up with one of them silver box. Uh-huh. I don't know who little buddy is. Something is finna jump out. I need to be ready and on guard. Oh, but I just noticed when we have these time jumps, his clothes are different. We just got an open door now. Reggie, ain't you tired of walking into rooms that you don't know what's in there? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, the little monsters. Get it, Reggie. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, good shot, little buddy. Good shot. Yes. Oh, because them things, stay trying to get red. where he at now this is so sad cuz I feel like they trying to paint the picture that it's all in Reggie's head because he's suffering from dementia and that's super sad oh oh <laughs> oh Reggie Okay, so he back in the other world. Sometimes it's one of us. When goes down, he re Wait, so a giant laser ball is gonna take down the world? Governments collapsed, society, people were sick. Eventually, their heads would swell up until they popped. The body count was immense. There was no cure. It's bad shit. Also, oh, wait. Where they take? Wait, what is going on in the real life? Where is he gonna take Reggie? Mm -hmm. Oh, they go to giant balls. Okay. man he is not a boy anymore he is a grown man oh they got Don slash Jane okay then let her go this turned into total recall Oh, is he gonna kill her? I know it is. It's tens of thousands of all of y'all. They not gonna stop the ball? Oh no. Mike has been activated. Oh! 
oh, this is good. This is turning to like a little mind battle. Oh, yes, yes, buddy came through. Mm, this got good. Yes. Ooh. Oh, he's gonna sacrifice himself. Oh no. Blowing up doesn't work. Blowing up doesn't work. Oh, oh, oh. So did they stop that timeline from destroying the end of the world? Will the doctor see him get that gun? Come on now, hurry up. Do the doctors not see that? He gotta kill Mike? Oh! Oh! I wish they would show us what's happening in present time. Like, are they really killing the nurses or? No. Good to have you back, Rich. We need more ammo. Can we get some shells? I got one. Let's go. Oh. Well, that's the last one. Who is that? Is that Chomp? Well, no, Chomp got blowed up. If he's seeing Jody, then he's near death because Jody is been gone. So for him to make a comeback in the other dimension, he's dying. And I guess Mike is dead too? Or, or maybe he just wants Mike to be there in his dream. Did Rich just die? Oh, I knew it. I freaking knew it. Who is that other man next to, uh, on the other side of him? I know y'all ain't trying to tell me Jody been alive all this time. He ain't never died in a car accident. What? So this been in Reggie head all this time? Oh no, Reg. Oh. Damn. We had a good time, Reggie. I enjoyed every minute of it. It was weird. It was strange. And I still don't understand any of it. But I liked it. Thank you, Reg. You were a trooper and a good friend. So this how it ends? It was all a dream. It was all in Reggie's head. Well, there's some Reggie somewhere in another dimension doing something. But in real life, he gone, y'all. Okay. That's it, y'all. We have finally exited the ride of Phantasm. Let's talk about it. <clears throat> okay, so... I feel like we... Like I said in the previous reaction, we watched the same dream over and over again and sometimes they will end up being more nightmarish than the other but i can appreciate that the series didn't end the way it began 
you know, we started off this thing entirely thinking this was all Mike. And to end it in more of it being Reggie uh, was actually smart. I'm still left with so many questions that I'm not even going to attempt to answer after watching Ravager because, of course, as we just saw, it made it seem like all of this was in Reggie's mind. He's suffering from dementia, so this is how he was actually, you know, coping with going through that. Um, I would have to admit, though, that I don't think there's any logic to the Phantasm world. You know, you just got a guy, Jebediah Morningside, a scientist, woke up one day, wanted to invent some type of contraption that would allow him to travel in time. And when he did that, he came back a demon. With his newfound powers, he went around kidnapping people and turning them into little monsters so that he could have friends. You know what I mean? Because, hey, that's what this is all about, friendship. Okay, so if I had to rate these from Clubhouse 81, I would give one a eight and a half. I would give two a eight and a half. I would give three a eight. No, I would give three a seven and a half. I would give four a seven and a half. And I would give five a 8.8. .8. All of these movies were actually fantastic to me. Um, I do highly recommend that you at least check out Phantasm 1 that came out in 1979 before you leave this earth. It is a great watch, you know. Listen, don't go into it trying to connect any dots or make... Don't try to make any sense out of it. Just watch it. Enjoy it for what it is. Uh, I believe the writer and director of this, Don Consarelli is his name. You gave us a great project, an original, authentic idea that did not sway away from its premise. And I also liked that this movie really didn't dive into any tropes. It actually created its own lane and set its own standards. And for that, it is a great watch and a great cinematic universe. Maybe one day we'll have a part six 
to the Phantasm world, but right now it doesn't exist. Uh, we've reached the end of monthly movie trivia, you guys. I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me while we reacted to all of these movies. We will be back at the beginning of next month in October to do our first ever movie battle on the channel. Until then, you can always catch up on the monthly movie tribute videos on the playlist for 2023. And until the next reaction, you guys, I hope you enjoy the rest of your September. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.